you guys don't want to acknowledge this on the air, but I'll acknowledge it on the air. I feel like it's unfair because you guys are judging Matt Ryan uh, next to Teddy Bridgewater, who will go above and beyond uh, following an interception to make a tackle, oh, and make wow. a or a turnover to make a wow. tackle, make a play. So I just feel like you guys are going. To, you know, he, the Teddy Teddy Bridgewater showed you he will do whatever it takes to bring down that uh, that defender if he's got the football about mm. ready to score. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know if you guys uh, know that or not. Can, you know? can, can our can our listeners understand? There was an an. <laughs> What was it? It was, a, it was a fumble that was picked up. I think, yeah, I think it was a fumble. I think it was a fumble. Yeah, it was a fumble. Yeah. Which I, I'm still curious about that call. By the way, I, I don't know where forward progress wasn't stopped and, and all that. But well, let's just get into the play. Yeah. All right. You'll see it. All you got to do is either you know put it in the old Google machine or put it in Twitter or whatever. You'll find it. <laughs> or, that's a business decision. As like Warren, that's that's Warren coming Sharp from did it. Warren Sharp said it best. It was, he called yeah. him Teddy business Teddy decision. Yeah. <laughs> that that. But here, can I just defend him for a second? Like, same comments I'll make now. Like, what is best for the Broncos moving forward? Is it Teddy starting this year or not? Because it is. Like, if, if you – like, we've already gone through Drew Locke, and, and that's, that's not really their best chance of winning. So, Teddy starting is their best shot. He made a decision, and I think probably what flashed through his head <laughs> is all the times he's been injured that have kept him out of being able to, you know, be at a different point in time in his career as a quarterback. Like, that's the reality of it. You know, his knee injury, granted, non-contact in Minnesota, but then some other stuff he's dealt with since. Like, that's what's kept him from ultimately being the guy that, you know, could be a a franchise starting quarterback. So he understands it. It's a business decision in the sense of, like, hey, if I want to be on a roster next year, the last thing I want is to try to tackle this guy and separate my throwing shoulder. It's not not an ideal look, though, you know? I mean, like, and here's, here's the other thing. You of all people sitting here saying, listen, I can understand what he was doing. Well, you, you, okay. Yeah, it, it wouldn't have been right. what I did. Okay, exactly. Because right? you're yeah. a meathead, yeah. and you would you would have tried you would have tried to maim somebody to get that ball back. Like, I, I would have move. jumped. I would have jumped on him <laughs> like a hyena. I, it would have. I literally would have. I would have just absolutely <laughs> I mean, tried to pick him up and body slam and get the ball out. I did, I just like, like what was what was the what was he trying to do? Like was he trying to nothing. give the yeah? <laughs> he was trying to do nothing. Like, maybe he thought the play was dead. I, I don't know. Like, uh, I, 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 I honestly, I honestly thought that's what he thinks. Like, hey, they're going to review this. They're going to see that this thing was dead. Like, it never should have went as far as it did. I, I, I really do feel like that's where this is going to go. Mm. I mean, look. There's some people out there. There's uh, reports that are saying that, well, you know, he he may have quit uh, on them. Uh, that he may have, uh, you know, he said afterwards. This is the quote from uh, from Teddy Bridgewater uh, afterwards. Uh, uh, it's the Q- oh so we, so we do have this as this is the qu- uh, the Q and A Teddy Bridgewater uh, the greatest tackler the league has ever seen uh, talking with the media afterwards <laughs> about so about his approach uh, in that moment. Slay, scoop and score. Did you think you had a chance at him? What happened as he's running down the sideline? You know, as I see it, uh, I see a guy trying to put a block, and then I'm just thinking, hey, man, maybe I can force the ball back inside. One of our guys will make the tackle. Yeah, it's just trying to force the guy back inside. I'll buy it. Listen, that that was uh, that was his approach. He wanted to force him back inside so somebody else could make the tackle, so they could get the stats and not him. I think that's a team player through and through. I'm I don't think he forced him anywhere. Like he just <laughs> no, kind of was did. there. He did. You know, <laughs> it was a very it was a very passive move to think about. Did I want? He was he was in his head. Like, do I want to engage this guy? Okay, D- does that piss his teammates off? I mean, it will look really, that. really bad in film. Yeah, it's going to look bad. It's going to look awful. I mean, like that's that that rewind. You know, coaches love to rewind film like a hundred times. <laughs> that's one red, of those plays with the, with the red laser. Like this is like this right here, and you keep rewinding it. This this right here. Like I understand you're a quarterback, Teddy, but this, <laughs> now, guys, I want y'all to understand this. Um, if anybody else does this, this right here. <laughs> This, uh huh, that right there, yep, yep. This right here. If anybody else does this during the course of this season, you will be immediately released and waived from this team. <laughs> it's just, yeah. Oh man, well, and listen. that includes you, Teddy. Yeah, uh, I, mean, I got to tell you, like you're you're I, our I, starting I, guy, but not, this one includes you too. You know, we we had a second year player when I was in Cleveland that Olada guy on the sideline, like literally. Tight end running down the sideline, business decision. 
just like flat out didn't want any part of that business. Now, and he was a smaller DB, so it, it really was like, a, hey, am I going to wake up after this collision? And it was a point of contention in the meeting after the loss. And I just I remember sitting there thinking to myself, like, man, that's the kind of stuff where you get labeled, especially that early in your career and that seldom playing, you get labeled with that. And then people start to look for him moving forward. So, granted, look, Teddy, it's a quarterback. I, I think we we all can realize what decision he made. <laughs> but to Lavar's point, man, you do that in a in a. I've, I've witnessed it. I've literally heard a head coach single like singular like point out this play and go off on a tirade for about five minutes. Oh yeah, dog cussing a player out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, even even in real speed, it's like, what are you doing, dude? Like, it, I don't, I just, I don't get it. I, it was almost like he was trying I, to cup think, check him. I, I think he thought it was coming back. I really do. I think he thought like, hey, this, there's no way the forward progress wasn't stopped. Like, this isn't going to come back. Oh it, man, I'm watching it. I, I didn't get to hear an explanation. Um, you know, from from any official, I, I didn't get to hear that. Portion. Well, you probably won't. Yeah, you probably right. won't. Well, the uh, NFL might. Well, d- he could have lit him up too. That's the thing about it. He had him. He had him squared up to hit that balance zone on the shoulder. You hit that balance zone. You showed me a man with no shoulders. I'll show you a man with no balance. And he had the ability to to really like like giving that side that little side. Ugh. You know what I mean? Like now, if he stays up. When you hit that balance zone on that shoulder, like, bam, you hit that shoulder with your shoulder. If he stays up, nobody has anything to say about it. You know, uh, you could have wrapped him up, but we we will overlook that. You tried. But that pump fake, like, you pump faked it. Like, <laughs> I don't know, man. Right. Like, it looked like he's he had the ball. Trip. It looked like <laughs> Teddy Bridgewater had the ball. Yeah, I know. Like, he was trying to avoid the contact. <laughs> like, he was, like, doing the, like, oh, little, little Lamar man. Jackson stop and going to the end zone move. It's just so bad. Uh, I don't know, man. <laughs>